Hi everyone, it's Gail, and back with part two on our little um, fairy journal, our fluttering wings journal. So we're going to get started in just a minute. Let's say hi and hugs to Brooke, Lulu, Celeste, and Janny. Thank you so much for watching and your kind comments. Okie dokie. First thing that I want to do is get some lace onto the spine. So, and I think I'm going to go, see which side, this is the right side. I think I'm going to go slightly over this crocheted lace because it is, um, you know, it's cut right there. And I think that will be just kind of nice. So, Let's get our, our Fabri-Tac, let's get our spatula. Let's do our best not to ruin our nails. <laughs> oh, the trials, the trials of being a journal maker. The fingernails are the first to go. Can tell I'm deep in conversation. No, not so much deep in concentration. Okay. Okay. There's that. Now, yes, yes. Okay, there we go. There we go. Good. Okay, we'll let that dry and we can, it needs a little evening up at the top, but I'm just gonna set this aside somewhere to dry. Let's just, nope, that's gonna craft a lanch on me. So, we'll put it over here. <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay, so I wanted to show you. I got these from yesterday all sewn up. And I think they're really, they're so fun. Really cute. For going over a page, you know. So I want to pick one to go with our, with our journal here. But I'm kind of wondering... What we might have to like decorate, um, honestly, I feel like either one will, will work. So let's just see what we have to kind of decorate with. Got little journal cards here that are super pretty but not exactly the size that I need. I almost put one of those on there. Okay, what else? Don't know that I'm gonna find anything that I really want to use. That's cute. Oh, I see. It's for this tag. It's cuter on the tag, so. And she's just a little bit too tall. Oh, but she looks really cute right there. Yeah, let's put her there. I'm going to leave that out to make that. Okay. Just going to work on a little ephemera, you know? Just, um. Uh, some things to decorate the journal so we won't use this one 
we'll use this one. So how y'all doing? Are you good? Sunday, having a, having a good relaxed Sunday, I hope. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna glue this, but we're not, we're not kind of going all the way to the top because don't want to close up the pocket because I got glue on it. I think I'm okay though. Okay. Oh, I love that. That's super cute. Um, do we want anything there? what's in here first before I kind of go rogue and find something else. Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. Almost could fit in there. That could have been in the signature, but I didn't. I didn't put it in there. What if we, okay, m stick with one thing. <laughs> um, let's do, let's do some sort of a label on there. Um, what? I'm going to look in my Tracy Fox labels because I kind of want like a similar color. Those aren't big enough. They've either got not big enough or too big happening here, I think. Okay. That's not bad, is it? I really wanted a bigger one of these. Oh, maybe not. Okay. All right, well, good. Let's put that on there. And then we'll need some sort of little tag to go in there, but I had a bunch of tags that we got from my pre-made ephemera. Maybe we can find something that's gonna go well in there. might depend on what page we have it on and you know what the page next to it is like okay so gonna go like that okay I think I think that's good I don't think I want to do anything there you know a person could put a pocket on this side as well but it's all sewn so we're not going to <laughs> Let's see what kind of tag. I got that tag. Um, what kind of what what we might be able to put in there. That could go, but I was thinking something a little. Maybe that one. Ooh. Oh, I kind of like the idea of going with the neutrals again. I think I might put that one in there. And here, I almost didn't grab this one. It's going to fit. Oh my gosh, it fits perfect. Okay, that piece is done and ready to go in the journal. So sweet. Okay. I wanted to show you this too. I grabbed a whole bunch of stuff. Um, 
all of this is from ePapery. And um, they're all these beautiful crochet pieces. Can be used on a book cover or on a page as a tuck. Let's see what this one is. Because I need, I need pockets and stuff for this journal, but isn't that beautiful? That would be a beautiful tuck on a page. Look at this. Or pocket. I think I might prefer it as a pocket. Need to put something there. I don't know what. But that's, that's a definite maybe. Hand crocheted oval frames with tag and ribbon. Flowers available in three si sizes, small, medium, and large. So let's see. Oh, look, it's got, it's got a little tag in the back. Ooh, what would be awesome is if we had a little girl face to go in that, wouldn't it? Mm, a little fairy of some sort. I have these little books that um, I got them at a garage sale, you can see. I mean, like, that little fairy might could go right in there. Might could, might could. That's my little, my little attempt at Southern speak, like my friend. Okay, so if I put that on like that, gosh, I think that could be really cute. Why not? Why not? do it. Just keep ourselves busy creating stuff for this little journal while it's while it's drying. Okay. There we go. And then I'm going to just cut around this. I'm falling off my chair. Oh goodness. Just crashing into everything. I have quite the mess. This is my fourth video of this day. But I had a lot going this week, so I had to kind of had to kind of get them done. Okay, so then. Oh my gosh, that's really cute. Okay. Well, I'm going to use that somewhere in there. I need to just give her a little bit of. They're so very clever with. Michael's the one that does the crocheting, I think. And I think Erin does more of their digitals and stuff like that from ePapery. But both very talented ladies. Okay, I love that. So we just need to put that on some sort of of something. I mean, it would almost like it would almost go on on a tag, wouldn't it? That doesn't do it justice. This is cute, though. Hmm, that's a thought. I th I feel like it's a little small for a page. That's that's why. I was looking that way. Okay, so let's see what else we have. Lace Tuzzy Muzzy. I have no idea what Tuzzy Muzzy means. That can be used as a pocket or tuck spot. Crochet tuck spots. 
Huggy Muzzy. Oh, those are just adorable. Mm hmm. It'd be a cute up tuck, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think we might use that one too. We'll put it with this one. Tuck spots or embellishments. I thought this pink one would be super cute on something. Well, they all would be, but oh my gosh, so fun. Lace butterfly with homemade ribbon flowers. That'd be cute just up on the side of a page, wouldn't it? Just as a as a page decoration. Yep. I don't know. I just thought all of these things would be really neat in this journal. Slow stitch book page book page corners. So these go like thusly in a journal. And they're all slow stitched. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Okay, so I think I've hit the jackpot with all of that stuff. Okay, let's see, how's my cover doing? Pretty, pretty good. Let's trim that. It's better. Oh yeah, I love that blue. That was that was what we needed. Okay, well, we could put some pockets on the inside of and back of the cover, couldn't we? What I'm thinking about with that is I've got these two that would be cute. I like this lovely one for right here because our little girl is so lovely. I need to move these over. I'm going to get them. I'm going to be squishing them. Okay. Yeah, I like that there. And then, is this too small? What do you think? Oh, I love it. It goes really well with every all the collage on the on there. Okie dokie then. I'm going to go ahead and put these on so they can dry. This one sewn. Well, they're both sewn, but um, sometimes it takes a minute to adhere when they're sewing sometimes. Okay. Let's do right here. Oh my gosh, that is cute. Just need to, I think I'm going to use this and just really smush that down. Okay. Oh, I love that. Okay, that's good. That's good. Now we'll put this one here. I might move it up a little. Then I kind of want to think about lace too. I wanted lace on the edges. Oh, you know what might be neat now that I think about that? See, I'm just like, just keep going one step ahead of where I'm at. <laughs> okay, let's smush that down really good. Good, 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 good. Okay, we'll let those dry for a second. Let's look here. Yes. Remember this stuff that I did some dyeing on? Let's put that in this journal. What did I do with those? I think I did the Distress oxide sprays, I think is what I did. I don't know. Okay, let's decide where to put those and then we can decide where to put other things. Ooh, this one. I 
think it'll be okay. Let's put the purple on this. Okay, and so we'll do the same in the back. Purple here. Okie dokie. And then, then let's do like, I kind of want to do the yellow next. Could we do on this page maybe? Oh yeah, that's nice. Let's put it there. And in here. In here. That definitely needs something. I have two backs together. So that's fine. We'll put that. Then I think I think towards the middle, I want this darker because the purple's really dark. Oh, and this is perfect. Yes. Look at this. Look at that with that envelope. Yes, yes, yes. And on this side, I'll do it. Do this one. Nice. That's going to look great there. Okay. Now. Kind of. I saw this and I thought, ooh, this would go over here. Mm-hmm. That's going to go there. And on the other side, we've got here with this. Yes. Yes. Okay. And then... Sweet baby girl right here. Sweet baby girl. Yeah, I can put that on there. That'll be good. And you are, which page? Wait a second here. Oh, that's right next to that one though. Where am I missing a few pages? Kind of right here. So maybe we'll put this with this sweet baby girl. Lots of sweet baby girls in this in this journal. That is for sure. That. Yeah. yeah that's okay there. Okay. Alrighty, some more gluing more gluing. I am definitely risking the nails today, but so far so good. Let's just keep our streak going. Okay, so don't want to go too deep with these, just like about halfway-ish. I think these laces are perfect. I'm excited. I was, I've been waiting to find a project where I felt like these were the perfect laces. This is it. This is the one. Oh, I love that there. Okay, cool. Okay, let's just do this one. Put it right side up to begin with so that I know what I'm doing. Oops. Speaking of knowing what you're doing, I'm basically gluing pages together, apparently, is what I'm trying to do. Love that one too. Okay, and then we've got this sweet baby girl. And that is the right side. Once we get the lace on, then we can kind of decide where we want to put things. And I know I have more ephemera that I need to make. I'm, I know I don't have enough. There's that one. 
this one. Let me get a little wet one. Trying to be a little more careful than usual. I just did my nails yesterday. Don't want to do them again. I'm thinking one of these days I need to go have a pedicure. I usually do that in the summer, but I haven't so far. I've just been doing my own toes. I don't know. It's, it's kind of funny, but I just have a hard time finding time to do that stuff so I'm actually going to lunch with friends tomorrow and I'm thinking about swinging by grape clips and seeing if I can get a trim on my hair because I think I told you I'm having trouble making an appointment where I used to go get my hair cut <sighs> I know I sound like an old lady, but I miss the days when people actually, actual people answered the phones. You didn't have to make an appointment online. I can't see where I can choose the hairdresser I want online. So. And it's to the point where it kind of made me mad. So now I'm just going to go somewhere else. Oh, I do sound like a little cranky lady, don't I? I mean, it'd be so quick. It'd be like, hello, can I make an appointment with Janie? She has this, this, and this. Oh, I'll take that first one. Boom, done. But no, they don't answer their phone. I suppose they figure they got to have ex pay extra people to do such things. But, you know, people who answer phones needs, need jobs too. I mean, that's what I did at the beginning of my career was answer phones. I know. Times have changed, Gail. Get with the times. Oh, you guys, I know what I can ask you while I'm gluing here. Have you guys watched Sweet Tooth on Netflix? Mike and I are in the midst of it. And I love it. It's um, based on books, children's books, I would say. Although, there's a few swear words in it, but um, it's so, it's so cute. And it's just, the action keeps going. So, you know, so Mike has been happy. So it's like, we're both really enjoying it. It's just been a fun, fun one to watch. We're on the second season, like, I don't know, the second episode or something. But I'm invested now. Got to see it through to season three. Season, I think it has three seasons is what it has. But if I've already asked you that, I'm sorry. But I thought about asking you and then I couldn't remember if I did. But I love it. It's so cute. Okay. I think I might have made it through unscathed. Some of those are going to need to be cut off, like at the top, but that's okay. That's easy. <sighs> okay. So let's see. We will cut these off as we see them. These little scissors cut lace fine. The other ones, not so much. The bigger ones don't really want to cut the lace. Okay, this one. This was a bit shorter page.
wonder if every time I turn a Rhonda without an H page, I wonder I wonder if she knows that we're thinking of her when that happens. I don't know. I'd like to think so, but I don't know. This one has just a teeny weeny little bit over. I don't really mind, but if I feel like it takes away from the page, then I wanna I wanna even it up a little bit. Let's see this one. Looks good. Okay. Oh, I love the laces on there. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Alrighty. Then where are we with stuff? Let's see. Let's check the time. Oh, we're doing excellent. All right. So we've got something here. Oh, you know what? I need to think about a, a fabric flip. Let's look at our fabric flips and see if just by chance we might, might have one. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Let's see. I mean, this one kind of would go with the colors. Kind of, kind of, kind of, sort of. This one may be even better. You know, that's not bad, is it? Let's just quick like look through and see if we find something better. I don't know that we will. Yeah, a lot of darker colors. It's a lot of my my friend's quilt scraps made into, into fabric flips. Yeah, it's a shame I don't have any to choose from. <laughs> what these are oh yeah I think these are like these are Timmy fabrics and oh look at that would be a good one for Christmas wouldn't it I'm gonna put that in my Christmas bucket okay oh and these ones for fall lest I forget about them I might toss them in my fall tub two this one yeah those are kind of fallish but Tim Holtzy okay there's three fall ones here I'm gonna put those over there so they can go into my fall thing I've had requests to do the owl journal and so I'm gonna need to get my fall tub out if I'm gonna do my owl journal Okay. Alrighty then. Let's pop those back over on the cart. On the cart where they live. Okay. Let me just grab a few things that were over there. Okay, these are... These are little hangers, you know, these little things. So, I don't know. Probably have enough of that with Michael's crocheting. I just wanted to see what those were. Okay, cool. Nothing we need for this journal. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's just cute little ruffle would be cute with this journal, but I think I've gone the way of more, what would you say, more um, antique laces. Vintagey looking. Okay. Okay, I do like that. I don't know if that's where I want it though. Let's, let's look. I think I want something on there. I don't know if that's what I want on there. But I kind of like it with that. Okay. Well, let's leave it there for the moment. Then we've got this little one. 
that needs to go over a page. How's about this one? And you can still write on all of that. And yet, I have a little decoration. Okay, I'm also wondering, you know, oh, okay, I'm having a moment. We picked this one out, but then I did this one thinking I was going to use it in here. So let's see which one we like better. I do like the idea of going over this. Let's just see. That's kind of nice, isn't it? Okay. Okay, this one's going back in the box. Okay. All right. So then we have this and these two things. That's going to be the side of a page, which I used a lot of the sides of pages for lace. So that might be interesting, although that spot might be pretty good, right? Yeah, let's put that there. Okay, and what else? Let's see, we got that there. Let's go kind of here. Oh, man. Look at that. I think that would be nice. Or do we want it on this side? I think I want it on that side. Can I tell you why? No. I don't really know. That's what's going to... Oh, no. I already put this on there. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. I mean, that would be good for writing, but I could also put that on there. Right there. Hmm. That's a possibility. Still, still looking here. I think I'm going to clip this. Do I still have, I had a, had a gold paper clip there a while ago. Must have done something with it. Oh, there it is. We might put some kind of altered paper clip on that too, but for now I'm just going to hold it there. I like that. Yeah, I think I like that. Okay, that'll go there. Okay, so where does that leave us? That leaves us with one, two, three, because this is a pocket, four, Okay, four things in front. Back, we have one, two, three, four, 
five. Okay, so we need a few more things. Well, let's look at, oh, we have our, we have these little things. Let's look for a spot for this one. Okay, so I need two things in the front, one thing in the back to do my six and six. Oh. Let's put that there with this sweet little girl. Okay, that's going to go there. I think this book's going to need a writing board because I'm going to use these things in it, which is fine. Oh, and I wanted to use this at the top of a page. Um, so that's got five. The other side should have, would have six. Let's see if there's a spot that says it would like this. Oh, I wanted to do something here, didn't I? I feel like I'd like more of a big pocket, but you know, that, that'd be really cute too. So on the other side, do I have two of those blue pages together? Apparently not. that okay oh it's it's attached to the uh, envelope okay it's one of the Rachel it's a Rachel thing okay so I need this off of here so I can kind of see but that's cute there isn't it and then just um glue at the top and then like put, I don't know, something underneath of it. Yeah, I think so. Okay, well, that's going to go there then. So that's six things on that side. And the other side, we, we have one more thing we could do on the other side. I mean, not that you have to, that that's a hard and fast rule by any means. But Mm-hmm, that's gonna go there. Just a pretty little page embellishment. Do I want it there? Do I want it there? I think I want it up there. Oh, is there a way? I don't know if that will work as a tuck. I was just looking at this. Wouldn't that be pretty, just tucked under there? Maybe we can figure it out. Let's do this. I'm okay. <laughs> Not quite sure. Let's see. I think I want to do this in aged mahogany. Don't know why really. Just, just feeling that. Okay, that's pretty. My husband's heading outside. I am going to go out after I get done taping here and warm up. <laughs> okay. That's pretty. Okay, so let's glue this on there. I'd like it up a little, but I didn't, so let's put 
putting it, putting it down a little bit. Okay, well, then I was looking at putting this on the bottom of this tag, wasn't I? Well, I guess I better do this side too. Okie dokie. So that's all ready to go in somewhere. And then this, is that where I want that? Let's just, okay, I need to pick up a little bit, guys. It's driving me crazy. Excuse me. But I have stuff all over the place. Okay, I have those, those. All of these little plastic thingamajiggies. Might need that one. All right. So I just want to see if I'm missing anything that's like supposed to go on that tag or something. You know, I mean, no. There's some pretty, that's a pretty one. I could put that one in the journal. Might as well use what comes in the kit, right? Otherwise, you end up with lots of leftovers. I already have lots of leftovers of lots of different kits. <laughs> okay. Love that. How cute is that? Okay, this, this, and this. No, nope. They're supposed to go on this pocket, which is another pocket we can use. Okay, cool. Okay, I think we're good to put that little guy on this tag. I think so. So, yeah, I think we can just put that on there and I am gonna do it. I love it, I think it's so cute. Totes adorbs. Okay. This one needs vintage photo. Mm hmm. Okay. We have these two tags. This is a tall tag. I'm not sure where it's going to go. It might have to go on a page. I don't know. Okay, we have that one and we have this one. And then we have these two pockets that I want to do too. Easier to do the inking prior to gluing them down. <laughs> Much easier on this part right here. Oh, my ankles are so cold. I'm looking forward to going out and sitting in the sun. It looks like there's not a cloud in the sky. So, get my ankles out there in the sunshine. I'll be warm. I'm sorry, I'll quit complaining about how cold it is down here. Okay. So, let's just pop the glue on these. I think I'm going to use a glue book to kind of glue on so I don't make a mess of my... Make a mess of my mat. It's already made a mess of, though, to be honest. Okay, I'll put that there.
darling, I know I something left long ago, but fascinating. You running around, important like, but it looks as if you quite a session, so, but only temporary. I don't know. Too much is missing for me to be able to figure out what that letter was about. Okay. So then there's that. And we might could put something, something down here. I don't know. Okay. Then this one just needs to be inked. And it needs to be folded. I am just going to take my bone folder and just kind of go down the line here somewhat. See if I can fold it better than I could if I didn't do this. Fine enough. Okay. Couple more pockets so we've got to go in there now. Cool. Let's do it. Okay, so you, you go in there, we know, but I was wondering about this on here. Yep, I really like that. I'm going to do that. So next time we'll be able to fill the pockets, I do believe. Next episode, if you will. Okay, and let's put this one over on this side. I've got that there, but... here. Yes, right there, don't you think? Okay, so this is going to be a tall, because of where the thumb hole is. I was thinking about having it a side tuck, but oh, I don't have all these glued in yet, do I? Now that I'm gluing these down, I'm like, Wait a second, <laughs> I haven't glued anything down. We've got a few minutes to do some gluing, don't we? Okay, so first things first, we need to get this down. Excuse my reach. Excuse my fabric tac while, while the bubble goes to the top. It's kind of fascinating to watch. It's like a lava lamp. Okay. There we go there. Okay. So there's that. That that okay we have this little one <sighs> probably should use fabric tack shouldn't I on the on the yarn I'm just going to go about here because um, it starts to curve up and I don't want to make the pocket so small it's going to go right there. And that's going to go right there. Okay. We'll decide if we want to decorate, you know, put something on that, on that blank area if we want to. Oh, man. <laughs> Just keep the fabric tack down here, Gail. <laughs> okay. 
So I so wanted this to be like a tuck. Just don't know if it's going to work, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try just going at the very top here and see, see kind of how it does. Oh my goodness, the strings. when I put it away I need it again that's how she rolls okay let's okay we'll see I don't know it might just be decoration without anything tucked up under but we'll see okay you're in there that's good okay this we can make as a side Tuck. I'm going to kind of put it about there, I think. Kind of in the middle. Really want to get everything glued in so next time we can just fill pockets with fun things. Okay. That's where it's going to go. <laughs> Once it's down, it's like, okay. That's where it's going to stay. Okay. This guy could also be a tuck. I think I'll scooch it over and try and use that as a tuck too. I have so many journal cards and things. At least it feels like it right now that I might as well make good use of, right? Okay. And that's in already. This slips over so that does not get glued in. That's there. Okay, we've got this, which I can use art glitter glue on. Yeah, you guys, if you haven't been to Be Papery, I suggest you check it out. They are a couple of talented ladies. I really love how there's so many, <coughs> excuse me, so many mother-daughter teams in our world. My daughter's not so much. <laughs> But not that they might not want to, but I think their, their careers just took them in a different direction. We only have this one to put on, you guys. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm going to put the glue on this because this is a little oversized. So hopefully then I can just... Pop it down and have it be where it's supposed to be, kind of. Okay. We did that. So, we're at a good stopping point. So, I think we will. And, um, gosh, it's getting, getting chunky already. And then, next time, we'll fill it. And we'll probably be done, don't you think? So thanks everybody so much for crafting with me today. I hope you have a lovely Sunday and have a grateful day. Be kind always. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.